the champagne. Yeah, I mean, pick your boat up and go for a warm down, perhaps. Yeah, I mean, right. it depends what her, what her plans are for tomorrow. I haven't seen her, her itinerary, if she's if she's doing 200s or not, but I think um, if she's racing 200, she'd want to be going out there and just you know, clearing the lactate out of her body and and uh, just, you know, just getting a, you know, a bit of feel back in her stroke. Well, I'm slightly behind on my timing. We just had uh, up there the fields put forward for the K4 1000 meters men's and the French look pretty good in qualifying that's Vincent Lecubier, Cyril Carré remember he's won an Olympic silver medal before Etienne, Hubert and Robert uh, Salet, so they're looking, they're looking pretty good, uh, Polish obviously we can't discount them at the moment they've got two teams in lane 6 and lane number 7 their 7th lane is a very very young team and also we have the Argentinians who are, who are here in force Argentina, much strength in depth? Um, it's, it's good to see some good numbers here. When, when I first sort of started in the sport 10 years ago, they had a couple of strong paddlers, but um, they, they, didn't, they didn't have a, sort of a, the size of a team that they have now, so it's great to see that it's, it's growing over there. And they're off. It, it. French there, looking down. I was speaking to Etienne Hubert, whose sister, by the way, uh, lives in Lyon, and uh, she, she used to be a top paddler, now retired from the sport. Uh, but, but still obviously cheers on the brother she's saying they were like a bit disappointed with their performance a couple of weeks ago but hopefully they're going to be on form now and lane number two Uzbekistan again uh, we don't know that much about them but uh, obviously putting forward a good team and right at the top uh, we just you may be seeing your picture is the, uh, the the Canadians uh, so they can hopefully put in a good performance Ben you spent much time in a this trick question hopefully not in, 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 a, in, a, K, in a K4 uh, not, not, not a lot. It's um, something that would, would have been enjoyable to, to do more of, but you can't do everything. And uh, my, my career sort of pretty much been focused around the K1. But it's, uh, it's always a nice change to better get into K4. You know, the national championships, you, you jump in a few club, and it's always good. France pushing it away in the early stages. We do have teams from Canada in lane one, Uzbekistan, Germany, a very young team there, born in 1994, 93 and 91. Argentina, France, two teams from Poland, a team from uh, New Zealand. What, what are the strengths of the New Zealand team down in the lane? Um, you four exuberants, they're uh, a very young crew. We've got a couple of 18-year-olds here and a couple of 22. Two-year-olds, they're a very young crew. And uh, Just see them at the bottom of your picture now in lane number eight. Yeah. They're not too far off the pace at the moment, are they? No, that's a great effort for them. Um, you know, coming, they're only, they're only so young, it's their first racing at this level and um, it's a pretty hard experience for them back in Zegert a few weeks back and they've, they've put a lot, a lot of work in to step up to, to be here today in the final. And the, the form of Argentina, they're looking confident, they're looking worried. They're looking... Yeah, they're, they're looking good, I mean... Paddles out good. front, big power. How you want to paddle K4? Coming through, he's the chap at the back's got his goggles on, it's obviously slightly, uh, slightly damp out there. I've, uh, I've spent a lot of time in the back of a K4 and uh, you, you get some water put in into your face quite often. 250 metres to go and it's still looking close. Yeah, Canada's up there for fourth, that's great to see, it's such a young crew. We have a junior and second of the boat, Marshall Hughes. Maybe France just leading as they cross the 200 metre mark. Very determined to put in a good performance. Total concentration coming down to 100 metres to go. France lane six, Canada lane one, and in the between them, the poles coming back really, really good. France nearly a boat length ahead, but Canada really striking it. Poland coming through. It's going to be France with 30 metres to go. Made up for last week's poor performance with an excellent win here. Canada might get a medal here. Canada gets bronze. Holy cow, that's incredible. <laughs> we can't say the word cow on the air. Right? Oh, cow, yeah, sorry. <laughs> that's a huge race. So good to see. France must be happy with it. Would have been disappointed for them, you know, reigning world champions, not qualifying into the Olympics. But good to see they're coming back with a big race. Maybe have a shot of the, of the Canadians. Briefly introduce the Canadians. Uh, man, that's, that's a big race for them. You know, they really got that finish. I think they had a good lane, and they just they just piled the way they know they're supposed to be paddling. A tactical third or an exhausted third? Oh, they're going to be exhausted. They're going to be ecstatic, but they're going to be exhausted. 
New Zealand got off with a great start here. You say you've got to spend a bit of time at the back here. Is it, is it, is it awesome, the feeling, when you set off? Uh, it's, it's hard. You're doing a lot of work back there. <laughs> but it's, it's a great feeling. There's nothing better than uh, winning a K4 race. And we saw the Czech team uh, two weeks ago in uh, Rachichi. Everyone was saying they're just so smooth. Uh, Well, being in the back of a K4, you kind of you kind of think, oh, Stroke's got it easy up front, like he doesn't have to do anything. And then you get up there, and the amount of control and you know patience you have to put into it is just incredible. So they did a really good job up front. The awesome foursome from Australia, they're clearly not competing in this series. Other priorities, they've had to be four years. Really hard work, but results: France, Argentina, Poland, Canada. Unfortunately, take fourth position oh, wow. from your point of view. I believe these are the unofficial results. We have to look a bit more closely at the moment. They're, they're, they're 0.4 of a second down, so it wasn't even that close. It looked uh, a bit 